better than people. I I did not look at the how to be alive. I was messing this up with that story. <laughs> so um, I'm redoing it with the proper titling and everything um, and the proper characters. So um, for this one, you do get a decent length of story where a few other stories might be like about a hundred pages, the meeting, figuring each other out, doing it, and then then saying, what's our status as of right now? Because like depending if it's a single story or if it's part of a series, um, they may continue on into the other books. Um, so um, I think this is a standalone work and um, it's a great story of, um, and it's another opposites attract type of thing. Um, you got Simon Burke, um, who's a like, shy graphic novel. Um, he walks Jack's um, dogs while he's um, recovering, like he has a broke, Jack has a broken leg. Um, Simon's helping him out with that by like walking his dogs. There's some sort of like attraction between them, trying to figure it out until they start like making out, kissing, have a bit of a relationship once Jack's cast is off. Um, Simon's like, well, you don't need me. This was likely a fling and everything. Jack's like, no. But in the process, they're trying to figure it out and um, the relationship and everything. Um, yeah, Simon worried that only with him because of the broken leg situation. Um, like, they figure it out. They become a couple and try and figure out what's being a couple for them being. Um, it's still, like a really sweet story, Jack being... Um, the extrovert one, Simon being the more introvert of the pair. Um, like, in a way, there is a slightly so slow build until about 165 to 170. And then it, pick it picks up the pace and everything. Um, but yeah, it's a nice, decent, um, well, more than decent, a good, um, kind of relationship building type of story um, of between the two so yeah I'll likely buy like in at least the, the ebook version of this um, but yeah better than people happy readings <laughs>